So up, y'all? Bring you guys in that video. Florian Marku versus Jorik Luisieto. I apologize if I'm mispronouncing his name. Uh, who do y'all think is going to win this fight? Before I get more into the video, I just want to say thank you. Thank you so much for watching. Please subscribe for more boxing and please hit that like button. It helps out the video. It helps out the channel. I'd really appreciate it. So, um, yeah, Marco and Luciero are set to fight for eight rounds the, this weekend, this Saturday on the 20th over in the UK in a boxer Sky Sports event. Um, I, yeah, I don't really know who's fighting that card, but uh, I recognized Marco's name and I was like, yep. Yeah, gotta make a video about it so <laughs> to those who still don't know who uh, Florian Marco is uh, Florian Marco is a 29 year old fighter from Albania uh, with a record of nine wins zero losses t one draw six wins coming by way of knockout TKO this will be his 11th professional fight he's coming off a split decision win against Maxim Prodan um, close competitive fight from what I remember and that was just a couple months ago and now here he is back in the ring before the end of the year against Jorik Lucero. Jorik Lucero is a 33 year old fighter from France. 11 and 2, 3 wins coming by way of Nagar TKO. And looking at his resume, yeah, he's gonna lose this fight. Um, yeah, I decided not to watch some footage of Lucero. I, I, I looked at his resume and I was like, yeah, this guy is uh, pretty much chosen to get beat up by Marku. That's what it is. Um, Luciano has fought relatively unknown fighters throughout his career over in France. He hasn't fought anyone notable. He lost to some guy named Stefan Zahil, who had five wins and two losses. And it looks like he fights at well, like 140, so he's fighting a bigger guy in Marku. Um, so yeah, that tells me that this guy is obviously cannon fodder, being chosen a sacrificial lamb for Marku to get a knockout win. That's the way I look at it. So I say Marku by TKO knockout before eight rounds so it, it's gonna happen within the eight rounds i'll be shocked and surprised if it goes the distance that would be uh yeah i don't think it's going to distance marco seems like he has a big following um i've been told that he had a career before this a kickboxing career um and you know he's an entertaining fighter i, I say uh and you know i think he 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 brings in a lot of noise and um you know he, he seems like he's fun to watch leading up to a fight and, uh, you know, it's definitely someone uh, I decided to to start following and seeing where how far he'll go. I definitely see him fighting. I could definitely see him fighting for a world title one day. Do I think he can w beat the world champions right now? Nah, but, but I, I can definitely see him fighting for a world title one day, depending on how, you know, the, the division looks, let's say, two or three years from now. Um, but we'll see. We'll see. Let me know what you guys think. Let me know your thoughts and comments. Thanks for listening. Thanks for watching. And like always, have a great day. All right. Thanks.